Hey, what's up guys? Trix here. Welcome back to another episode of Terraria 1.2 with TVXCW. We are back in our Terraria 1.2 Let's Play world, and sorry, I'm still a little bit sick, so my voice might be kind of raspy, and I might be kind of sick, uh, or coughing and stuff, but this episode, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? Well, I'll tell you what we are going to do. We are going to go to the dungeon, which now has new enemies in it because we have defeated Plantera, which is awesome. Let's get a different pixie because I don't like the pink one. Yes, green. Green is my favorite color. Green or blue is my favorite color. I don't know. But we are going to go to the dungeon. Ah, sweet. Our little, whatever his name is, Pygmy is flying on his spear, which I think is really cool. So let's hop on our monorail. If that's what it can be called, I don't know if it is. Um, and we will head over to the dungeon, which is just over this way. So let's uh, carry the fallen stars. Jump over here. Hello. <gasps> wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. Truffle, truffle, truffle. There's something killing me. Awesome. Auto hammer. We got the auto hammer. Sweet. So now we can make... um. Whatever that stuff is out of the chlorophyte. Shroomite. Shroomite. Yeah, I think that's what it's called. We can make shroomite now, which is awesome. Because that's better armor than chlorophyte. And we should probably have shroomite armor before we fight Gollum. Although, maybe chlorophyte's fine. I don't know. We have all of our chlorophyte, right? Good, 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 good. So, here we are at the dungeon. I should probably build a second um, minecart rail going down to the jungle. Because I... I am going there quite frequently now. So let's just head down into the depths of the dungeon and we will explore around and see these new enemies. Hello. Oh, we have the uh, the Crimson Key Mold. Or sorry, not the Crimson Key Mold, the Hallowed Key Mold. I really need to get the Crimson Key Mold because I want some vampire knives. But we have the Hallowed Key Mold, so we just need uh, some souls. And we'll be able to open up the hallowed chest, wherever that is. Uh, where are all these new monsters? Angry Bones, that's not new. Uh, ooh, but that is. That is very new. Whatever that was. Ooh. What is that? I don't know, and why do I... Why can I see them? Pygmies. The pygmies will fight for you. Is that what they look like? Hell Armored Bones. Interesting. Ooh, it's a, a giant cursed skull. Oh, this is so crazy. All these new mobs, they're so cool. Did I just stand on top of the bookshelf? <gasps> is that is that new? Why, why am I standing on top of the bookshelf? Interesting. What? What was that? There are so many new drops that we can get, new items we can get from this new post planetary dungeon. This is awesome. They need they need a shorter or easier word to say than post planetera. Plantera. Like there's normal mode. Hey, it's a traveling merchant. We'll have to go check him out because I want a fez. So there's like, I guess a normal mode or something. Then there's hard mode, and I guess I think next up is extreme mode or insane mode, something like that. What the heck? I should get away from that. Oh wow, I'm already almost dead. <gasps> 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 Inferno Fork! We got the Inferno Fork! <laughs> oh, Bone Lee was right there! <sighs> we got the Inferno Fork! Oh, I've heard such great things about this! Oh my goodness, we got the Inferno Fork! That is awesome! Uh, Fez? Ah, no Fez. You do have a tiger skin, though. Um, we got the Inferno Fork! That's like the coolest thing. That's awesome. Let's let's go back to the dungeon because we died pretty quickly and I probably should have healed up. But no matter, we will heal up along the way. Oh, oh, the inferno stuff. Sorry, my phone just went off. Yep. All right. Let's continue on to the dungeon. All the way over here. Hello, Mr. Truffle. We will come by the auto hammer from you soon. Oh, I almost made it. I should probably make a jump from there to there or something. Oh, why am I why am I doing that? I sorry I was distracted by a text somebody sent me. So let's head back to the dungeon, jump over that because I'm awesome. Ooh, my uh, chlorophy thing is fighting for me. Hello, slime, die slime. There we go. And we have launched, and now we will go to the dungeon. Okay, we are back 
We are ready to be mauled. So let's just heal up real quick. And we've got, oh yeah, I should dupe, dupe, and a dupe. I think I can just press buff, because uh, I don't have any other buffs on. But let's just keep our terror blade swinging, so that way we can survive. Let's just descend down here, all the way down here. Let's just explore around here, check out the uh, hallowed key mold area. There's another Inferno Armor Bone, or whatever he is. This guy, this guy is really annoying, because he keeps uh, leaving the traces, and whenever you hit him, he teleports, it looks like. What is killing me? Seriously. Oh, oh, I'm an, I'm an idiot, standing on spikes. It's the swamp thing. <gasps> ectoplasm. We got ectoplasm. Awesome, ectoplasm is good. We can make armor. Ectoplasm, is that a frog? No, that's a giblet. Um, ooh, another giant curse skull. Let's go get the SWAT one. I should probably come through here and clean up all these spikes, because spikes are annoying. Just die already, thank you. Ah, everything is killing me. Feels like I'm being bullied. I don't like it. <laughs> okay, all these things will die. Yeah, I really need to go through here and clean up all these spikes, because these spikes are really hurting me. These hell armor bones are really cool looking. How they're all fiery and stuff. Just like my timber. Anyways, what? Oh my goodness, that's a lot. Where's the SWAT guy? Is that the SWAT guy down there? Yes, it is. Hello. Oh, that's my pygmy. I keep mistaking my pygmy for a monster. Stop triggering the spike trap. Seriously, or the dart trap or whatever. I don't care. Let's go down here. I'm looking out for some... Well then... I'm looking out for some blue armored bones so that I can get the last piece, the armor polish, for the, uh, the Ankh charm. So let's heal up at the nurse. Gosh, this, this dungeon, it is pretty crazy. Uh, that didn't register as a buff, and neither did that. Anyways, um, what might we need? Might we need, let's, let's go grab Demolitionist, you crazy. Let's go and move you right up here, back where you used to live. Let's go grab an Iron Skin Potion and a Platinum Coin while we're at it. Ah, there we go. Iron Skin Potion and a Platinum Coin so that we can go and buy ourselves an Auto Hammer. That way we can make ourselves some Shroomite. Okay. Now, let's head back to the dungeon one more time and then I will realize that this was an unsuccessful dungeon run. But it was pretty cool to experience these new mobs. So, let's go over here. Run this way. What are you firing at, Pygmy? Come along. Come along, Mr. Pygmy. Let's go back by the auto hammer from the truffle, and we will continue to the dungeon. Where's our mini-map? There it is. Awesome. Woo! Way zoomy. Okay. And, oh, yeah. Get out of that, you given. Why, why does that keep breaking? Bada bing, bada boom, auto hammer. Two ectoplasm. That is really good. Ectoplasm is good because I can make like rogue armor out of it or something. Let's continue on our way back to the dungeon for the third time. Oh wow, this dungeon is really difficult. I was not prepared for this. So let's uh, just hop out of the minecart. Boom, that was pretty cool looking. And let's buff up. Five minutes of iron skin. That should be good because I probably won't last that long. Let's keep our terror blades swinging. I'm probably going to go through and remove all these spikes because they are dealing quite a bit of damage to me. It's small, but it's a lot because they deal a lot of damage in a short amount of time. So, oh wow, we are we are really getting absolutely mullered. A certain Gavino Free would say. Oh, there's my gold coin. Sweet. Oh, ooh, what's that area? I haven't seen that area of the dungeon before. Interesting. Uh, oh, that's a cave. That has dungeon in it. Who is firing all these things? Did that blue armor bones drop armor polish? Now. Is that a gold coin? Now. Let's go over here. I need more blue armor bones. So that I can get myself my armor polish. Where did all this stuff come from? And what is that? Is that gold? I don't know. Nope, it, it was nothing. 
Continuing. Oh, hey, look, it's the jungle chest. Sweet. Let's... We need to get that crimson key mold as soon as possible because the crimson key mold is good. Uh, giant dungeon slime. I don't really care about golden keys anymore. I don't need them. Hello, giant curse skull. That giant curse skull looks really cool. There's the crimson chest. The hallowed chest is somewhere around here. There's the ice one. Oh, where's the hallowed one? It is. I don't know. I want. I want my sniper skeletons and my blue armored bones and my tactical skeletons. And where are they? I don't see them. We're so close to being able to get the onk charm. We just need a few blue armored bones. And there's one. <gasps> Necromancer, give me your staff. Uh, die wherever you are. You son of a gun. Die. Thank you. Gosh, I'm slow. This is why I need the Ankh Charm. So many blue armor bones. Must kill them all. I need to kill them all and keep them on my screen so I don't lose them. I need the armor polish. I need it. Need it. Let's kill that guy. Uh, keep these blue armor bones in my sights on my screen. There we go. Okay, one of these guys. One of these guys has to give me the armor polish. Ectoplasm. Awesome. You just murder everybody. It's like a giant murder hole down here. These these new uh, caster enemies are quite difficult because they teleport after one hit, which is quite annoying. And they give you slowness. We are about to die again. But... Oh, hey, look, it's the, uh, the hallow chest. Awesome. So we found the hallow chest. Urgh, hello, come out and bite me. There we go. Giant cursed skull. <laughs> More like kind of giant cursed skull. It's actually kind of terrifying looking. And now appears to be able to shoot me and stuff. Yeah, blue armor bones. And a necromancer. Like, oh my gosh, so many necromancers. Oh my gosh. Die already. Die. Uh, uh, gosh, we need to end off this video soon, but not just yet. Kill everything, kill it all, kill it all. Uh, so much ectoplasm. It's a necromancer, <laughs> necromancer nerd. Just terrorblade, work your magic, work your magic, terrorblade. Come back here, necromancer. Come out and fight me. These necromancers like Endermen, they teleport away at like the first hit. Oh! Oh! Thank you, Pygmy. You are a good Pygmy. Blue armor bones, I'm coming for you. Just give me about 900 years. And there's some red armor bones. Oh my gosh. That is a ton of blue armor bones. They're all in one area. Oh, this could be it. This could be our chance for the armor polish. What is blowing me up? It is a paladin. There's a paladin here. Paladin is a mini boss. In case you don't know. No! No! Oh, skeleton commando, why? There are blue armored bones and a paladin. No! Oh. Oh, well. Anyways, guys, that was the post plan Terra Dungeon. I have no idea how long this video was. But anyways, guys, thank you all for watching this video very, very much. If you liked the video, then be sure to like the video and subscribe to my channel for some more awesome Terraria and Minecraft content. I will see you all next time. Goodbye.